Hey crypto enthusiasts, welcome to the channel. In this video, we're going to be giving you updates on two projects that um we have done and how to be able to claim on one and the update on the other. Now, the first one we're going to be talking about is Flow. If you remember, we claimed an NFT from it, and now there's also another free NFT. It is good to always be collecting NFTs like this. Why? Number one, they are free, and number two, they could have value in the future and this is good to just hold them till that time comes around now to be able to claim this this is the nft for their second birthday so i'm going to be showing you how to claim this so make sure to participate in this and follow along as i do it now if you go to your to the mail that you were you signed up with you have to search for flow they sent a message and it's about claim your free NFT for Flo's second birthday. Now what do you have to do? You have to scroll down and click on claim in Flo app. Once you click there, you open through Chrome. It will now redirect you to the app where you can see Flo turns to. It is a free NFT. So you click on get it now at the bottom. Now you have gotten it. And once you click on claim, confirm your wallet, and it is done. So you have successfully done it. If you check in 24 hours, you'll be able to see the NFT. Now the second one is going to be Ice Network. Well, a lot of you have probably been seeing news on Ice Network, and this might... um not be as early but well if, even if it's not as early there there's there's now more updates i'm going to just join it together in this video now i'm going to go to the first part because that's where it truly started and that was here it says important announcements now let me click on it it says we've always valued your feedback and in our continuous effort to innovate we're excited to announce a significant shift in our approach we decided to launch the ICE token on the Ethereum blockchain during phase one of our project. Furthermore, while listing ICE on the Uniswap decentralized exchange, enabling it to be traded even in this early phase. This strategic move is designed to expand our user base and provide liquidity to our early supporters. As we gear up for the mainnet launch in October 2024 and the beta testing of our mainnet app slated for Q2 quarter to next year we believe this will foster great community engagement and trust to be eligible for the ice token release on the ethereum network participants must meet the following criteria these are three important criteria to be able to eligible for the early release in phase one number one successfully complete the face recognition of in step one of the kyc two successfully complete step two of the kyc details of which will be shared soon Three, maintain a minimum of five active tier one friends. Each of these friends should have completed both steps of the KYC and have a record of at least seven days of consecutive mining sessions. Last, we'd like to highlight that the distribution of ICE tokens will be on a weekly basis leading up to the mainnet launch. This means you will have the opportunity to assess more tokens every week. The ICE token will be available once our team releases both steps of the KYC process. The tokens will be spreadable from Ethereum to ICE Open Network blockchain once Minnet has been launched. Thank you for being a part of this journey. Together, we are reshaping the future of decentralized platforms. Now, a lot of people have seen this um, announcement as controversial, but I don't see it that way. Well, the criteria are a bit hard for some people, but the good news is that they have said in another tweet, we're going to show you what they said about it, so there's no need to be disheartened. And even if you have to take it in um, next year, look at the bright part. Mainnet will be launched, and they will not be doing it on their own blockchain. And it is going to definitely going to be lesser fees than what Ethereum would charge. And you'd be able to hold more, mine more, and you could even get a, um, a bonus for being someone who held on to their tokens. We'll also be going to be showing you that too. But about the KYCs, whatever come out of that, we're going to be showing you. They have not brought out any of the KYCs, but they have said that they're going to bring it out very soon. So we'll wait for that. Now, if um, you have any questions, 
you can ask in the comment box regarding this but i think that being patient is not too hard they're still going to give us free airdrop you can check their white paper and their roadmap this is going to be one hell big project and it's going to be a very massive project so i do not want any of you to miss out on this although some people have been complaining but please be patient with them they are trying and doing their best now the second part is going to be about what i talked about the five active tier one users it says it does not mean your coins are lost if you do not have five active tier one users who have passed kyc it means you won't be eligible to receive your tokens on ethereum in this initial phase one step you still need to wait until october 7 when the mainnet is launched and that's when you receive your tokens now they are saying that this is a, a requirement for phase one but your tokens are still secure so there's no need for you to be too judgy or jittery about it your tokens are safe they're just trying to see people who are committed and to even show your commitment there is something that they put over here they said as phase one concludes on 7th of october 2024 the top 300 miners who have held onto their ice coins without selling would be elevated to elevator status because retaining their tokens they have shown unwavering trust in the project the long-term vision of the project so this is good news for those who are mining so keep on mining don't stop if you want to understand their project more read their white paper ask reasonable questions do research tell people who are coming to the project to do research watch their youtube videos and support the project this is a big project and you shouldn't um, be backing out now once you are done they also said that um pre-stake will be reset so you can have the chance to reset to stick again or on stick if you do not want to stick so this is another announcement another one is that over here the import the kyc announcement they said kyc step one will commence next week emphasizing their commitment first kyc step two your understanding of the ice project will be assessed we will strongly encourage a thorough review of our faq knowledge base and white paper based on our available on our official website additionally our youtube channel provides in-depth videos elucidating eyes distinctive features so they are trying to make sure that people understand their project they don't want any dull person and that is the reason for this kyc too so make sure to go to their website and read all you can understand the project and if you understand it you understand why you have to be patient and yeah that is basically all about it they are bringing out a presentation video soon and they are saying that it's going to show their consistent consistent quality so you can watch out for that and that is all about this for those of you who are feeling annoyed or left out just be patient we are all in this together and if if it means waiting until october 24 we're going to wait and wait for the mainnet to launch and don't forget the new features and apps that are coming out so we'll see you till then bye